What's going on you guys? This is your boy Chance here. Um, thank you guys for checking out this video um, and my channel. Ultimately, this video is going to be about how to do a proper step over, right? Um, first of all, this is one of my favorite moves, especially from the dribbling and also one of my, um, a lot of professional players use it in dribbling as well. Um, I'm going to go through three types of scissors or step overs as they call it. One being the single step over, two being the double step over, and then lastly the third being the type of stutter step over. So we're going to go over all three. So stay tuned to this video and I'll show you guys how. All right. All right guys, so the first step over we're going to do is just a single leg step over, right? Um, ultimately, this, moves only, this move only works when you, you sell the fake or you, you drop your shoulder when you're doing it, right? Um, if you look at it without the step over, if you do a simple, you know, drop all your body weight and your shoulder and you go the other way and explode, yeah? That's how you beat the defender is, is using your momentum to, to fake them one way and then also using um, your, your burst of speed to go the other way, right? So ultimately what the step over is, or the single leg step over, is just you're coming in, small touches, right? Small touches like you're dribbling, you step over, and then you go the other direction. But let's just say whatever foot you're, you're, you're going to step over with, I like to be on um, the opposite side. So if I'm going to step over on my right side, right, um, I want to be on the, the left side of the ball. Or if you're looking at it, it's going to be your, your guys' right side, right? And then vice versa, if I'm going to step over my left foot, it's going to be opposite. So it's going to be on the right side of the ball, right? So we're going to step over here. Um, the trick is, is to get the ball at a speed where you feel comfortable, where you can do the, the, the move properly without um, losing the ball, right? All right, guys. So this is the first technique of the video, the single leg step over. Definitely go at defenders with this move. Remember, the change of pace is what really makes this move what really makes this move pop. All right, so keep practicing. All right, guys. So we're moving on to um, technique two, right, which is the double step over. Um, ultimately, this step over is just like the first one, but you're just adding another step over on it, right? Um, same rules apply, guys. Basically, you want the ball to be rolling at a certain speed where you can do your step overs or scissors under control and then also um, bursting to the opposite direction. Um, also, guys, another thing, when you do these step overs, you don't wanna be you wanna be over the ball, but you don't wanna you don't wanna be too over the ball where it gets caught in your heels, right? You wanna be over it where maybe I'd say your heel and the midsection of the ball is is in between your legs yeah so it's boom boom and it's fast okay and then here's some clips all right guys moving on to the second technique of this video the double leg step over or multiple step overs uh, basically robinho and christian Ronaldo does these the best these are so sick when you do them especially when you see them on tv or in highlight videos so definitely practice one as best as you can but other than that keep working on it all right Right on guys, that was awesome. I'm glad you guys are doing it. Now we move on to the last one. And this one's kind of my favorite, um, just because it, you can adjust um, when you're doing the scissors or the step overs. And what I mean is, usually you do a step over and a step over, but sometimes if, the, if you're going at a really fast pace um, with the ball when you're dribbling at somebody, that if it does get away from you, that's why I like to stutter step. So I call this one like the um, stutter step scissors or crossover. Um, a person that does it really well is Cristiano Ronaldo and what he does is he'll he'll run with the ball very fast and he'll step over and he'll, he'll stutter and then until he does another one, right? So he's finding, I'd say it's 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 kind of a timing thing that you guys gotta learn over time when you when you use this move or um, especially in game situations. Um, obviously practice as much as you can but especially when you're dribbling in game situations or even high intensity training guys, I would highly encourage this just because you're going <coughs> and you want to time when the opponent is um, coming at you, but yet you want to judge the distance between you and the opponent. So sometimes to make a reaction from them, 
I'll do a stutter step. So you kind of you want to you want to bait the situation where you want them to dive on you to to step in or try to win the ball. Just because that stutter step throws it off, yeah. Because usually people go one explode or they go one two three and explode. But this one is one stutter stutter two, right? So you kind of throw off the rhythm of it. So check it out. All right, guys. Lastly, we're looking at the stutter leg step over. This is one of my favorite moves and also the Cristiano Ronaldo does it really well. I believe if you really practice on a lot, you can pull it off in a game and it looks sick when you're doing it. But remember, practice makes perfect, guys. Keep working. All right, guys, just a quick recap of what we just went over. Um, first of all, yeah, remember, sell the fake, guys. You have to sell the fake. Um, drop your shoulder. Yeah, get into it like you're really gonna go that way and then also your second thing change your speed especially if you're going in the opposite direction um, remember you're changing your speed and your pace is what um, beats your opponent yeah a penetrating dribble they would say um, <coughs> also when you do this move be aware of the spacing between you and the defender you don't want to do it when you're too close yeah you want to find a good distance where you can do the move and yet turn um, the uh, opposite or the different direction and there's a distance between you guys so you can't tackle you right okay um, also just to recap on the, the three types of step overs and, and scissors um, first the single single leg step over right where we're just doing one and then two remember the double leg um, you're doing two or multiple and then lastly remember the the stutter step step over all right um, I'd just like to thank you guys for um, checking out this video and being on my YouTube channel. I really appreciate you guys coming and taking your time out of your guys' day um, to take a look. Um, I'm here to help you guys. Please, um, if you guys can do this for me, is you know, like, comment, and subscribe to my videos. Um, I would greatly appreciate it. It helps me um, build more videos for you guys, which I love to do and help you guys. And just remember, guys, always practice, 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 practice. I can't stress it enough. Um, that's the only way you guys get better. Um, but until then, my name is Chance, and you guys have a blessed day, all right? Take care.